let me show you how you can actually speed ramp audio in Premiere Pro. So it's no secret that speed ramping audio in Premiere Pro is a pain to say the least. But here's a workaround that actually makes sense. First, I'll make sure to unlink the video from the audio. Then I'll right click this FX icon, go down to time remapping and select speed. Next, I'll go to the moment I want the slow-mo to start and I'll use the pen tool to add a keyframe and then I'll add another where I want the slow-mo ramp to end. Now on our audio, make a cut exactly where our two video keyframes are. Then I can just drag this line down to slow my footage down to around 50% speed. Now, as is the main issue with speed ramping in Premiere, you'll notice the audio doesn't slow down with our footage. But not to worry, we'll fix this in a moment. Next, we just need to grab these handles and ramp our video slow-mo. Then move our last audio section to the right and make sure it lines up with the last ramp handle here. From there, we can use our rate stretch tool to slow down the audio until it reaches the following audio clip like so. Now this is where the fun starts. Search for the effect pitch shifter and apply that to the slow down audio clip. Then we can open up this individual parameters tab and create four keyframes for transpose audio that line up exactly with our video speed ramp handles. Set the value of the second and third keyframe to 50 to match our 50% slow-mo speed and ease the keyframes in and out. Finally, I find it helps to add a crossfade on the audio clips as well like this. Now, if you want 10 more useful audio tricks just like this one in Premiere Pro, then make sure to check out the full YouTube video linked in my bio.